Welcome back. <laughs> so, I have a story with mice. A story of a mice of men, but in real life. I had one in my roof, and I could hear it. <laughs> like the little scratches and like yes. the little squeaks. Well, mainly just like the pitter patter around. Okay, okay. And I was like, I I'm done with this. I don't like mice in general. I don't like like I, I most critters like that in general. <laughs> I hate most living things. <laughs> yes. I just started throwing the decon bricks everywhere. <laughs> so like, my room is the most toxic place next to like any gaming forum. And on the bright side, uh huh. I laid one in the center of my floor. Not here. Oh, okay. Over there. <laughs> and I was like, let's see. Yeah. Day later, it was gone. What? Which is good, because what they're, it's designed to do is they bring it back, at least, like, most poisons, it, they're designed to be brought back to, like, their nest. Oh, so what you're saying is you're you're killing a family of mice at the moment. Yes. Ah, I see. So, like, what if, like, when you were trying to get rid of these mice, it was a Tom and Jerry moment and you were Tom? Uh, I would be fucking furious. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, turn around the corner, just the mouse pulls out like a giant hammer out of its imaginary pocket and slams your toe. I would get one of those old timey mouse traps that's just a fucking gun. <laughs> but other than that, I've had an eventful day already. Oh, yeah? I woke up, my dad's like, get the fuck out of here, we're moving shit. <laughs> so I had to go. You know that hill right in front of my house? Yeah, yeah. It's pretty steep hill, right? Like, yeah, it's, it's, it's just a wee bit. Yeah, I think it's pretty decently sized hill. Yeah. Uh, we had to take an old car, and I had to stand behind it and push it so that it wouldn't go down the hill too fast. Ah, so you got, like, your daily workout in. Yeah, daily. <laughs> <laughs> Monthly and workout. My brother was like, well, let's try to do this, 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 and this. And he's like, well, if I kill you, I'm like, if, I kill, if you kill me, I'm, I'm fine with it. <laughs> if you run me over, at least make it quick. WHO? WHAT? MILITARY HAS JUST FALLOUT 4 ARMOR? I mean, that's Fallout 4 armor on steroids. <laughs> and that's impressive for- Because Fallout 4 armor is already steroids. Jesus! Uh... Hey, just- just anal probe the machines. That'll work. I, I love how I grabbed that and it was like, yeah. <laughs> No, see, it didn't- it didn't like that you grabbed it. You have to like caress it. I'll kill you. <laughs> I'd like to see you try. Right here, right now, during recording. Please don't. <laughs> Dude, what is up with his hair? Oh! Shine off the ball. Use it as a weapon. If someone tries to shoot you. Just go like, look at the ball. No. Disney owns like most of like entertainment now. Yeah, I think they actually almost have a monopoly on fucking everything. At least movies. I, it wouldn't surprise me. I think they own um, they own Marvel, they own Fox, they own um. I think they they have to own Nickelodeon now, don't they? Uh, I don't. I'm not sure. Hey, let me let me check. Viacom, CBS. Who owns Viacom CBS? That's a good question. Uh, it might be its own thing, because Viacom's fairly fucking huge. Uh, National Amusements. They always have fucking boring names once you get to the top. Like, it, names that were obviously made in, like, the fuck 40s. Holy yeah. Holy shit, that frames. I was gonna say, wasn't the reason why Disney was named Disney was because that was just, just the guy's last name? Yeah, Walt Disney. Hey, look! You've upgraded from receding hairline to just purely bald! Yep. Congratulations! And I love how that guy's just not gonna question that you can somehow do that. Eh, it works. It's, it's, your, it's your big bald brain energy. Yeah, I mean, Crypto's bald. It's just his natural state of being. Yeah. What a sad life. <laughs> Same with his holes. His holes? Yeah, the things that pulsate. You can make your holes do that. I guess that's true. <laughs> yeah, I guess I could clench. Yeah. But, like, it's just not naturally doing that. You know? Oh! Oh, okay. See, the angle made it... I thought it was just his head. They just chopped off his head and put it on the table. Like, hey, look at this, guys. Also, I don't think we've ever seen Crypto with his eyes closed, so that was just weird. Yeah. 
It could be that like their eyes turn white upon dying. Oh, they like shrivel up. Don't worry, Crypto. I'll make sure you're after. <laughs> can, you... can can you? <laughs> you know, it's kind of funny. It's just like, oh, Area Fifty, or this is Area Forty Two, or something like that. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's like top secret facility and everything. Let's make it nice with all these palm trees and like bushes and nice grass and everything. I mean, morale helps troops, so I can see it. Uh, yeah, that's true. It's like, oh, all these nice things, and then just right inside, it's just dead alien body. Oh, hmm, that's okay. Do you think we've actually ever seen an alien, like, as a human race? Oh, probably. Oh, okay, then, I got stopped. <laughs> I, I could, if it came out that we've, like, had one in, like, a facility or, like, a dead corpse of one, it wouldn't surprise me. Fuck off. We're just, like, secretly keeping zombies in a bunker. I mean, there is that spore that infects ants. Yeah, that's what Last of Us is based off of. Mm. Which would be kind of just game over. If it if it uh, evolves to affect people, yeah. Mm. Yeah, we're kind of screwed. Well, because, I don't know, I guess we could control it, but yeah, there'd always be that threat. Yeah, next thing and Based you... off of how humanity is reacting to controlling something now. We'd be so screwed. Yeah, I think we'd be pretty well buggered. Yeah, we'd have people going like, there's no zombies, and then be bitten by a zombie. Well, I don't think the zombies would attack people. I think they'd just go to, like, a skyscraper and then fucking explode. Right. It's Professor X. Yeah, Professor X before he became a cripple. I think that's offensive. It's not accurate. I mean, it is accurate. It is accurate, but I, th I don't think they like the word cripple. <laughs> oh, sorry. We got paralyzed from his legs. That still didn't make any sense. Paraplegic. Paraplegic, thank you. I, did, I couldn't forget it. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm having a hard time here, sunshine. <laughs> My brain's not as good as it used to be. Which is kind of ironic considering that we just finished. That's not a high bar. <laughs> yeah, we just run into Professor X and it's just like, hey, what's up, man? And then just kneecap him. <laughs> I mean, the timeline must be kept pure. <laughs> I guess. Yeah, he, 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 Crypto ends up liking Mr. X. He's like, sorry, man, I gotta make sure the timeline's intact. So, no fucking game I'm super excited for. What? Black Myth Wukong. What is that? It's a game about Sun Wukong. I don't know who that is. Goku. I now know who that is. It looks to be kind of like a fucking um, Dark Souls s game, but you play as the Monkey King and you can turn into a cicada. Oh, huh. That, huh? Interesting. So okay, I I love how like Souls like is just a genre now. Yeah, I'm pretty happy with it, honestly. Why? Because you want to just continually bash your head against a brick wall? Yeah. You're like yes. Sweet, sweet relief bleeding from the forehead.